Assuming you've watched the other tutorials and you've got your map set up and have uh, probably added locations, um, you're now ready to add the map to your page or your post, depending on where you want to place your map. This is done with a very simple short code. Uh, you can place it anywhere that you have a page or a post on your site. Uh, of course, every theme is different, but Mapify is pretty flexible and it lets you specify uh, the, the height and width of the map. So it can pretty much integrate with any theme out there. The number one thing you're gonna remember uh, that's gonna change your short code comes from the map itself. So under the map settings, under the specific map, each map ID after it, each map after it has been created is assigned an ID. Uh, since you can use unlimited maps and create as many maps as you want with the Mapify Pro Edition, um, that's why the software assigns an ID so it knows which map to display where. Uh, so in this example, we have a map ID of 34, which we're going to want to include in our short code. So we will just create a new post for this example so I can show you how that works. Um, to get the short code, it's in the documentation. Uh, I will show you here, you'll see it on screen, but if you wanna copy and paste it, it's in the readme text. Um, also in the forums, it's really easy to find, but yeah, just check out the documentation. Um, I'm going to add a new post. You can see I've already done some demos here, but let's just create a new one and title it test map. And what I'm going to do is paste the short code and you can see my map ID is 34, just like the one I showed at the beginning. Uh, it is custom dash mapping space map underscore equals 34 in quotes, height equals 900 in quotes. Um, pretty simple, you can add a width parameter also, height and width, so you can specify the exact size map that you want. Uh, and that is pretty much it. I'm gonna go ahead and push or click publish there to publish my post. So if this was a blog, for example, I could have the full blog entry here, an article, I could post the map in the middle of an entry, um, and that map will have every single location and feature that you've added via the map locations and your map settings. So um, you, can, you can create a map for each and every single post if you wanted. So let's just go ahead and click view post to see how that turned out. And as you can see, my map ID was 34, so it's displaying the same map from my demo um, with all of the features intact. And uh, since I don't have a blog on this demo, it's showing a full screen because that's just my template. Uh, the map is going to adhere to whatever template it is pasted under um, or posted under. Uh, according to your theme. But again, you can control it. All I did was a height parameter for this one out of 900 pixels. Um, again, you can control height and everything via that short code. So be sure to check out you, your documentation to find that short code. And that would be it for posting a map.